Insurance is getting more expensive for middle and high school athletes in our area. Alan Frio is live in Green Hills tonight. Alan, the people who run school sports programs are really worried about this. Yes, they are. In fact, I talked with the executive director of the uh, Tennessee Secondary Schools Athletic Association. And while insurance, of course, is still available to cover young athletes here in the state of Tennessee, it is getting very expensive for them. And injury-related deductibles fall on parents. The executive director for the Tennessee Secondary Schools Athletic Association, Bernard Childress, says insurance coverage is a big worry for him. He's kicked the insurance can down the road for now. They assured us that uh, we still have coverage and we will have coverage actually agreed upon a two-year contract. But it came with a steep price. They uh, have raised our premium uh, and also our deductible. And the brokers piling on more bad news. The pool of insurance carriers available to cover young athletes is shrinking every year. And he's down to maybe two or three companies now. Most insurance companies won't even touch it. TSSAA represents 130 middle and high school athletes in Tennessee. Their yearly insurance premiums have skyrocketed to $560,000, a massive $60,000 increase. And deductibles have gone up from $10,000 to $25,000 for each injury. We did not want to raise the deductible, but we got to have something that, you know, the association can afford and our schools can afford. If an athlete is seriously injured on the field, that $25,000 deductible rests on the parents' shoulders. It does fall on the parents. We always tell our schools to make sure that those student athletes have primary coverage because this is secondary coverage. Someone's going to have to pay that deductible. Someone is going to have to pay, and it's going to be the parents. And by the way, TSSAA is spending one-third, one-third of their budget on insurance. It is a growing problem, and it's not getting any better. Tom, Tracy. Alan, thanks for that live report tonight.